so nice. Mm, took the day off. Just to cuddle with you all morning. Mm, it's so nice cuddling with you in the morning right after we wake up. I'm so proud of you. I really am. You're always doing such a great job and I don't think you appreciate yourself enough for it, so I wanna I wanna help share in that effort to make you feel like you're doing a really good job. Because you really, really are. I really want you to know that. Makes me so proud to just see you working so hard every day. I don't know what I'd do without you, you know that. You really are just the most amazing woman in the world to me. And I just adore you. Especially that time you got there. Squish, squish. <laughs> and some things might be hard to get over, but I manage, you know, just that really big, stuffy collection. Mm, taking up all that space. And I know that your stuffy addiction is only going to get worse. <laughs> I know that every time you see one when you're scrolling you just you just throw it in the car and you hit buy and then there's another one to add to the collection that I have to remember the name of <laughs> Yes, I know. I try to remember them all just for you. <sighs> I'm so, so sleepy, you know that. I'm <laughs> glad we stayed up so late fooling around. Having some quality time. It's very, very physical time together. I really liked massaging your back for you. I really liked brushing your hair for you. You're just so amazing. I love you for it. You're everything to me. Forever and always will be everything to me. <laughs> you can make me tear up. <laughs> Don't. Uh, you don't have to say those things back. It's supposed to be the morning where I'm trying to get you to feel good. That's what I want to do. <laughs> Stop. You're going to squeeze me too tight. You're going to make me pop. Do you want a popped balloon for a boyfriend, huh? No. <laughs> He's squeezing so tight. Hey. What if I what if I don't turn into a pop balloon? What if I turn into a whoopee cushion, huh? Yeah. If we go right in your neck and just start blowing raspberries. <laughs> That'd be too tickly. Yeah, I'm not ready to wake you up just yet. I wanna keep you like this. I wanna just Enjoy all the little moments we have together, you and I. Yeah, just... So... So very mine. <laughs> I'm running into things to say because I'm so sleepy. I 
that's my favorite. I'm going to mix up words here. My favorite. My favorite smile in the whole wide world. <laughs> you must know it, because I, I know you use it to get your way all the time. Yeah. I'll be gaming with my friends, you know. Playing some Warzone or something, and you just, you just come in, and you just give me that pouty lip. Your puppy eyes. And I'm like, I don't know if I want to bake right now. I'm kind of busy. And then you switch to that smile and go, pretty please. And it's just, it's just irresistible. You know, I'm not saying that like it's a bad thing. I know you're not. I mean, I, I, I know. It's, I give up. <laughs> just give me a kiss already. <laughs> oh mine uh, Yes, I'm all yours too No sharing No sharing with anybody mm, Yeah, I will get very jealous If you go around hugging other boys I'm glad you're not that kind of person mm, You never make me jealous Yeah, I'm glad I understand that. I'm glad I understand your boundaries. I never want to make you uncomfortable. I never want to have any problems with you that we don't sit down and sort out together. You know, besides, or who won, you know, who won while we're playing like Mario Kart or something. Yeah, it's definitely me, by the way. Shh, 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 shh. I love you. I love you. No, you can't refute it. Don't you? Hey, you trying to say you don't love me back? No, no, no. This isn't about Mario Kart. This is about me loving you and how much. I'm just better. Um. Why? Well, you no, know, I didn't say anything. Don't worry about it. <laughs> hey, it's not my fault. Not my fault you don't know how to drive. <laughs> Get good. That's all I have to say. <laughs> hey, don't poke me. I, I already said I wouldn't bug you and wake you up too early. What are you doing, you little, you little rascal? Little rapscallion? What do you say we, uh, we make some pancakes this morning? You know, of course. Yeah, we can add all the chocolate chips you want. I want to. I want to add some blueberries though. And uh, I know we have a lot of a uh, lot of um, what is it? A lot of maple syrup left. Got a whole lot of it. <laughs> yeah, you know, my friend recently. He, uh, he tried making, uh, you know, like ramen noodles. Boiled it up with, like, diluted, uh, maple syrup. And he, uh, he tried some noodles with, uh, <laughs> basically maple syrup in them. And I hear that it was, like, 10 out of 10, so maybe we can waste some noodles trying to recreate that. That, uh, that stoner combination. <laughs> that would be really nice. Yeah, I want to mess around the kitchen with you, of course. I know how much you like your little treats. I know how I'm a big, smart, big happy. I can't words right now. You're distracting me with your beautiful face. I know how happy you get when there's days I bring home you some nice flowers that I picked from the, uh, what's the store called? I don't know, it's just this big, like, kind of greenhouse looking thing. There's, like, the metal structure and, like, the plastic wrap over it. 
And then people grow flowers in there. A lot of fucking flowers, that's for sure. Anyway, enough of that. <laughs> what was I going to say? Have I told you how proud I am of you yet? How much of a good job you're doing? Yeah, what if I need you to hear it again? What if I need you to hear it all the time? I just don't want you to forget. I don't want anything to like demotivate you. I don't want you to feel like your effort like not enough or something silly like that. Because 1000% you'll always be enough for me. I wouldn't trade you in for a bajillion dollars. Unless I could buy you back right after. <laughs> yeah. No, no amount of money would get me apart from you. No amount of money would, like, keep me from you. I would make sure that we always have a future together. That's really important to me. Sweetie, of course I want to get married to you. I want you to make you my wifey. <laughs> that ring finger, that finger would look this words. <laughs> Frick. It would, it's, it just makes me nervous, you know. Talking about it before I actually propose to you, like, what if it's not a surprise? What if you're, like, expecting it at every turn? I don't want you to, like, start expecting it. That's all. Because what if you think it's, like, the perfect moment to, for it to, like, happen or something, and I just, I think there might be a more perfect moment to get set up, you know? Or maybe, uh, hmm, or maybe there's just, like, I gotta find the perfect ring for you. It's gonna have a little cat engraved on the side of it. That's for sure. Like a little cat just like, you know, like jumping forward, kind of stretched out with like a cute little cat face. And then there's gotta be a nice little, little pink gem on it. I think that'd look pretty on your finger. Yeah, I think it'd really compliment. chocolate chip blueberry pancakes with maple syrup on them and potentially ramen with maple syrup in it. My thing, baby. Baby. Hey, don't fall back asleep yet. I'm not done talking endlessly at you yet. I'm not done monologuing about random shit about you that makes me happy. Silly. You still smell so good. Mm hmm. Of course. Mm hmm. Oh, that's really sweet of you. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Mm hmm. Oh, hey, I'm giving you like the same responses. say extra then <sighs> this is supposed to be showering in you showering you in love morning not not flip the script around on me jeez how did that happen <sighs> i was supposed to do that silly goose oh yeah Squish back into me. Just get nice and comfy for me, baby. You're my good girl. My baby girl. It's making me 
you're so sleepy how warm you are. Yeah. I'd never leave you just untucked at night. I have to tuck you in. I'm gonna show you how much I care about you at every every chance I can. I don't want to make it overwhelming. I can't just say it out loud all the time. I'm sure you know it and believe it. It's the actions that matter. That's why I have a dinner date plan. Nah, shh, shh, shh. I didn't say anything. I'm sleepy talking. No, nope, nothing, nothing said there. No fancy plans for us this week at all. Nope. Oh, come on. I just wanted to take you to, like, that, that restaurant on the beachfront and try some seafood, some sushi together. I know it'll be really good. And then, if you're still hungry after that, there's actually another place I wanted to go check out. This is a Korean barbecue place. And I think it'd be really good to sit with you, just eat food, really good food. I don't even know what we talk about. No, I mean, in the moment I will. I'm so rambly right now. I'm just full of like, I don't know, bubbles. Does that make sense? My feelings are full of like warm bubbles, and they just pop in every time you give me like a little little smirks and smiles, and it's just like. Sometimes it does happen that fast. Sometimes it does feel like a, I can't speak. Stop trying to make fun of me. You no, know, don't put your finger up to my lips and try to... Fine. Let's make you happy, huh? <laughs> Is that what you wanted? Mm, okay. You know I'll do anything for you. Oh, hey, sweetheart, baby girl. By the way, um, I'm really proud of you, you know that. I'm doing such a good job. Always, always, always. Always making me proud. I'm proud to have such an exceptional woman with me. I love you so much. I love you to death. <laughs>